the actress against the gymnast. And here's Louisa Litton, formerly of EastEnders and The Bill. She's had a yeah. tough time in training this wow. week. And so we're oh, fortunately on her side this time. Oh, this is a terrible start. Unbelievably slow. Ridiculous. Oh, it's going to be a big, big task to make up for that. Looking down, she won't be able to see where she's going. Well, she's terrified, but she really does have to look up. She's taking a good position now and looking good. And let's see what her split time is. 20.16. Well, frankly, I thought it would be worse than that. So she's obviously made up speed. She's gone down the track. That won't help now. Sideways on. But she's going much quicker than before. 93.82. So she did pick up quite a lot. But that start is surely going to cost her 45.71. Oh, Beth Tweddle, the most successful British gymnast of all time. Taken to this skeleton with great style and confidence right from the word go. Good start, far better than her opponent. She's off away very well indeed on a good line. What a contrast with her opponent. The eyes are up, taking it all in. Couple of brushes off the wall, but nothing too serious. Coming out of the Chrysler to the split time. She should be well up. Oh, but she's only a tenth of a second faster. That really is a surprise, and we could have a total surprise unless she picks up speed on the second part of the course. But that she is doing with a vengeance. 96.83, that's the fastest so far. Brilliant start from Beth Treader. So lovely to watch you do that. And both of you, in fact, have got such nice positions. But you, you were so shaken in your um, track sort of time when you first tried it. How did you feel on race day? I literally just closed my eyes, pretended I was you kept in shot bed and went... <laughs> I couldn't look. look at all. No way, I didn't want to see that. Do you need to look? Do you need to look? <laughs> Do you know what? We were getting ready to go, and like the guy was saying, Can you see my hand? And she's like, No, I don't really want to see your hand. And I was like, Louisa, look where you're going. And she's like, Not right. a chance. Eyes shut, whole way down. Yeah, I sang myself a song, and away I went. <laughs> and you, of course, I mean, it's just lovely to watch you going down there. Do you enjoy it? I loved it. Absolutely. I would go straight back up there, and literally, I spoke to my coach, and Such I said a good to her, fish. Well, I said to her, all I've got to do is hold my arch position. She said, well, at least we know you can hold that position. Yeah. Just go No, you can do that. <laughs> OK, so it is the moment of truth. Once again, the winner stays. The loser's going to face the air jump to stay in the competition. Now, <gasps> Louisa, you raced first, so let's remind ourselves of your time. So, 45.71 seconds. So, Beth, your time needs to be under 45.71 seconds to avoid the air jump. So let's find out your time. <laughs> Do you want her to do the jump as well? Please. No. Hate no. Jump. She hates it. I she hate had a headache this morning, didn't you? I hate it. Um, Louisa, you've got to take on the air jump, I'm afraid. So you go and get yourself ready. Give it up, please, for Louisa and Beth. Yeah.